The 2010 Mercedes-Benz E63 AMG is big and it's expensive and it's worth the $100,000 asking price. Mercedes completely updated the E63 for 2010, making it one of the world's quickest, best handling and most elegant sedans. Even so, some would show off the new Porsche Panamera stellar track numbers to tell you it's superior to the new E63. But what the E63 has is this and this. The 2010 Mercedes E63's magic begins with the same AMG engineered double overhead cam 6.2 liter V8 used in the previous generation E63. A new alternator and low friction coating for the cylinder walls help bump up power from 507 to 518 horsepower. But the big change is the elimination of the torque converter in the Benz's transmission. This E63 gets AMG's recently designed, more responsive 7-speed automatic from the SL63. And further updates have been made to the E63 suspension, with firmer coil springs up front and a wider track relative to the standard E550. As a result, this E-Class feels transformed. On narrow mountain roads, the car seems to shrink itself around us, thanks to awesomely precise steering, remarkable chassis control, and of course, oceans of power. This might be a large sedan, but you'll never know it from behind the wheel. Four shift modes provide progressively quicker shifts and more aggressive throttle response. On the same knob is a position labeled RS for race start. This mode is difficult to engage and its results are barely quicker than the car's default settings. Still, it's the mode we use to record a 12.7 second pass through the quarter mile at 112.4 miles per hour. 60 miles per hour arrived in 4.3 seconds with one foot of rollout. Stopping from 60 miles per hour required just 114 feet and was utterly effortless for the Benz's 14.2 inch rotors, six piston front and four piston rear calipers. Our high expectations for the E63's handling were verified by a speed through the slalom of 68.8 miles per hour. A performance almost identical to the last BMW M5 we tested. We then drove the E63 to its grip limit, which yielded a .90 G average around our skid pad. Not bad for a 4,341 pound sedan. With only a few exceptions, Mercedes has made its numerous interior features easy to use and impressively functional. The blind spot assist system is too sensitive in a city with as much traffic as Los Angeles, and you end up disabling it rather than put up with the false alarms. Tally up the various fees and options, and the E63 costs just more than $102,000. For that sum, you get enough space to comfortably move four large adults, enough handling to stun many smaller cars, and enough power to move your soul. <laughs>